Oh, you would not believe it. Claire's, $5. <laughs> These are anklets that actually Egyptian belly dancers use, but actually I got them um, at a uh, Ren Fair Fest. I bought them, you know, put them on a chain. This is actually a dancer's belt. This is a type of coin belt. I don't belly dance, but if I if I could, I would. But I have a lot of these kinds of things. These are another type of anklet bracelet from India. The Indian uh, traditional, uh, the Asian Indians, they actually wear these around their ankles and accentuates the rhythm of their dance. This is actually from Peru. This is a nut rattle that the bomba players play. They put it around their wrist so it becomes sympathetic. So when they're hitting the bomba drum and it accompanies the pan flute, they get that, that beautiful water sound, you know? Yeah, so this is just a little smattering of things. Over here, tuning pens from a piano. These are zills, another type of instrument that belly dancers or flamenco uh, accompaniment. Uh, and these are another type of uh, Indian bell, different weights. There's small ones and large ones here. I love uh, the sounds and textures when I get to work with Elizabeth and her music. It's about creating a tapestry of colors to support the lyric and, uh, and the melody, you know, and it, it accompanies the, the drums really quite well, and of course the bass and the beats.
Hi, I'm Elizabeth from Heard. Watch World Jazz on Look TV. Yeah, this tune uh, features lyrics written by Zork. You're going to be singing in Ga, which is his native language from, from Ghana. There's 45 languages, I think, in Horn and, and, and Ghana, and this is one of the main languages Ga. And uh, this melody we came up with at the Troy Farmer's Market, where we, we play here and there. We love playing farmer's markets. It's like a festival every day. So uh, this song is about you know, what goes on at the market. Come by here. Don't walk away. Check out my stuff. Give me your money. Don't walk <laughs> away. Don't walk away. Kayoshimi. Right?
Yeah, this next tune is called Cote de Neige. We don't have any songs with titles in English, really, except for maybe market song, right? Uh, so that means um, Snow Coast or Snow Hill. There's a boulevard in Montreal, winds up from downtown. It's called Cote de Neige. This is a little different feel. This is more on the jazz side of world jazz. But that being said, you're going to hear an amazing instrument uh, featured. In this, in this piece of Salato. Yeah. Explain to me what this is. What this is. Well, that's this is my Game Boy, you know. Everybody has a Game Boy. Game Boy? So this is my Game Boy. Mm -hmm. And we call this a Salato. You know, if I'm going back in days in Africa, like maybe 80th century, you know, we don't have a toys. You guys have a toys here. We don't have a toys. This is our toys we use. So I can just show you guys my levels on the toys. Okay. okay. So,
called Calabash. And uh, this is a Calabash. Those are so and so are really sort of a Calabash, right? Any sort of gourd that um, has been filled with something for the bottom of the line. Breaks up the versus dry, wet, dry. But calabashes are also used to get out to the river and haul your water home, right? So this song's about let's go down to the river with our calabashes clean water and bring it on home. And this is a traditional song from, from Zorky's home. He taught it to us. So it's our cover tune.